He says, you expected much, but see, it turned out to be little. What you brought home, I blew it away. This is God. He said, yeah, I know how frustrated you were. I know how you could never find happiness. Guess what? You were a pie gobbler, and I am almighty God. And so what you would bring home, I blew it away. I wouldn't give you what you wanted because you were obstinate and resistant to being the people that I called and created you to be. Friend, if you are here today and you know what it is to be frustrated, if you don't ever seem to be able to get to that place of true inner peace, I tell you, under the inspiration of God's word and out of the deepest love of my heart, it's because God's not first in your life. It's because at best you've made him the caboose on the train of your life. He needs to be first, and when he is, the blessings will follow. He said, what you brought home, I, almighty God, blew it away. Why, declares the Lord almighty, because of my house, which remains a ruin, while each of you is busy with his own house. The reason why you could not find peace, it wasn't the devil, friend. Oh, the devil's coming to get me. No, God's coming to get you. Because he will not be mocked. And so often we are our own worst enemy. I have seen the enemy and it is me. I have been in that place. I dare say each and every one of you have been in that place. I come to you today in case you're still in that place. And I say to you from God's word, come put him first. Come make your life about his living through you. We have an opportunity, friends. God has brought us here to build his house. He's building a house in St. Johnsbury, Vermont. I believe he's going to be building a house in Kampala, Uganda, and I believe in southern India. And he's calling us to be a part of that. Not with the crumbs, but with the core of our lives. See what he said. I ask you, what do you want? What do you want? I mean want, want. Pie-consuming want. What does a portrait of your time say that you want from your time? What does a portrait of your talent say you want with your talent? What does a picture of your bank account and your spending habits say that you want with your treasure? God's asking the question of those who have been privileged to build his house. And he's making it very clear that this is important to him. And I need you to know it needs to be important to us. Not under any guidelines of legalism, but under the umbrella of love.